Hey guys, it's Arika Misha, and today we're doing something quick, simple, and easy. Today we are having meatball subs. Just nice little quick meatball subs you can whip together in about 10 to 15 minutes. All right, first thing I have here is my, by now you guys should have seen my Omaha uh, steak box unboxing. So today we're gonna be doing the Omaha steak meatballs. And these are the Omaha steak beef meatballs. And they're fully cooked. So they're already cooked, so I'm just gonna put them in the oven and heat them up. And I'll show you guys, this is gonna be a quick video. I'm gonna go ahead and get my meatballs in the oven. And then I'm gonna show you guys how I'm gonna go ahead and make this nice, delicious looking meatball sub. So, let me go ahead, I've got my pan already over here. You know I stay ready, and the stove, y'all can hear the stove is ready. I've got my stove at 350 degrees. I'll probably uh, bake the meatballs. Like I said, they're already fully cooked, so I'll probably be baking them for about maybe 15 minutes. That should be long enough, because they're frozen. Well, mine's not really frozen, they have frozen, but anyway. 15 minutes should be good enough. Let me go ahead and get my scissors so I can get these meatballs open. These are some pretty giant meatballs. So, and I'm going to end up cutting these in half because they're pretty big. So, all right. So, let's get our meatballs all organized here. Looking good. Looking good, meatballs. And then I'm going to spray my meatballs. Hold on. I already sprayed my pan. I sprayed my pan already. I'm going to go ahead and just spray. Spray my meatballs a little bit. All right, got my oven at 350 degrees. So I'm gonna go ahead, let's get these grilled up and then I'll come back and show you guys how I'm gonna put together uh, the meatball sub. Quick and easy meal, guys. Let's go. Okay guys, I'm back. Just wanna show you guys real quick how I'm gonna make the meatball sub. Uh, quick and easy. Okay, so we've got our sub bread down. Um, I'm using the ragu sauteed onion and garlic. Um, I've got some Sargento mozzarella cheese, and it's kind of be kind of like a pizza style kind of sort of, but let me show you guys. All right, so what I'm going to do, I don't want to put the sauce on my bread because that'll just make my bread soggy. So I'm going to go ahead, put the meatballs, and of course I cut my meatballs in half because they were really big. So I'm just going to do it like this. Some meatballs on this side. All right. And I'm going to put some cheese on this side like that make it nice and cheesy I don't want to do too much cheese and then I'm going to take my sauce and I'm just going to put some sauce across the meatballs like that just kind of drizzle the sauce like that I'm gonna do it because too much sauce will make your meatball uh, will make your bread soggy. I don't like soggy bread. So all right, so we got our meatballs nicely covered. I'm leave it like that. And I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna do. I'm just showing you how I'm doing one. So let me move this over. I've got my pan that I cook my meatballs in, and I'm just gonna sit it in here. Just like that, just like that. I'm gonna do three across here and I'm gonna go ahead and put them in the oven and toast them just like this. And then when you get ready to eat it, you know, you just fold it over and everything just melts and meets the sauce meets the cheese, the less cheese, all of that, all of that, all of that good stuff. So y'all seen how I went ahead and prepped the subs, the meatball subs. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other two and then I'll be back to show y'all the Le Grand Le Finale. Okay guys, we're back with our subs. Quick and easy meatball subs. You can add whatever you want to it. I've got the mozzarella shiz. Quick and easy subs. I put them in the oven for about five minutes and they are done. Take y'all into those meatball subs. Kinda like a pizza sub, you know? Quick and easy. All right, well, y'all seen me do it, so you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to love, comment, share, and subscribe. Have a good day.